Hello everyone, welcome back to another industrialist tutorial. Today we're going to be going over this pretty good iron coil farm right here. It creates around $460 a second. I would recommend for medium players, for players in the mid game. What you're going to need is going to be on the screen right now. That's what you're gonna need. It's gonna cost that much. And at the end of the episode, we'll go over the model count. I actually built a over here already. It's right here. You need, I believe this is 15 iron drills, five uh, electric furnaces, and then uh, 10, oh no, yeah, 10 of uh, assemblers. Oh, not assemblers, sorry, sawmills. And then you need one, uh, what is this, a roller? Yeah, one roller per sawmill. And that should get you quite a lot of iron coils. It's enough to fill up this 400 space truck really fast, as you can see here. If we check here, our money gain money gain is pretty high right now but that's just because we just sold it we'll check back in a second to see how high it is but when i measured it before it was 460 a second could be more actually yeah it seems to be a lot more than that it seems to be 1250 a second not bad pretty good yeah right there you see more accurate, 1,000 a second. Okay. Alright, first, what you'll want to do is grab your iron drills. And you will want to place 15 of them. So right here we have six. Oops. Six. Nine. Twelve. And then finally... 15. Then you are going to want to grab, where is it here? Electric furnaces, you're gonna, you will want to grab five of these. Place them like so. One, two, three, four, five. Out of that, you will want to grab your sawmills. Well, actually, you need to put the uh, molders first. Where is it? Ingot molder. I'm pretty sure we only have one ingot molder. Yeah, right here you can see we only have one ingot molder. And that goes into ten of these. So we'll place our one ingot molder right here. That way this can go like that. Now we want our sawmills. Like this. One, two, Three. Actually, you could place it farther to the right. Like around here. One, two, three. Oops. Should probably place it like this, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You will want one roller per one of these things. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There we go. And then we just want to put a truck. Let's get a truck going right here. 
You don't have to use a truck, but I suggest to use a truck because it because you will definitely have a lot. I mean, a lot of uh models here. Actually, we could place it closer, can't we? Yes, we can. Look at that. Look at that placement right there. Oh, actually, though. We need to place the uh, pipe here, though. Let's just see quickly if it would work. Just to see. Still works. What about can we place? Where is it? Okay, so we have to place that first. Like that. Actually, we're going to use long pipe instead. Because long pipe's just better. It uses less models if you use the long pipe. So we're going to use it. All right, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine right there. Pipe junctions, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oops, we don't need ten actually, we need nine. And then you need to get, you will need, 11 of these This is just for here alone though, you'll need more in general 11 11 turns 12 yeah, okay, this is going to be 21 turns and Then we'll have 30 31 here Thirty-one here plus another one, so thirty-two turns. We'll put that down right now. Thirty-two turns. Uh, fifteen drills. Five furnaces. One molder. Ten sawmills. Ten rollers. Then one. One uh, truck so far for right now. Three, no, wait, no, that's 12 right there, I believe. 12. This is going to be 10 here, so it should just get to 20. Okay. Then, hey, when that happens, where is it? I really hate the organization here, the pipes. It's uh, it's annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <clears throat> ten, and then another ten here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. Then everything over here is good. Yep. Wait. There we go. Everything's good here. <clears throat> All right. We will need, where's fluid, long fluid pipe. Just like that. And that's one, two, three, four, five. 
five long fluid. That's going to be five normal fluid. Oh no, five short fluid. One fluid turn. Four fluid junction. That looks correct. Yep. Now we just need to hook this up. This is the most annoying bit, but it's not that bad. All right. One, two, three, four. No, one, two, three, four, five. So that's five turns. This is going to be 37 turns. 37 item turns. Uh, 20. Did I say that? 20 long item. 20 long item. Where is it? We have 20 junction, item junctions right now. It's about to become 10, I believe. I believe 10 will be the next amount. Or we're going to add 10 to it, so 30. So 30 item junctions. And then and then ten short item. And this is this is all you're going to need to make this. It's actually a really small farm and it produces a lot. A lot of money. Where at least for mid game it does. It does for mid game. Let's grab our huge truck depot here. Just like that. And then it's up to you how you would um how you will power it. Personally, I just like putting a, I'm trying to find it right now, power. I just like putting this in the middle, because you can, there's a space in, in it. But just to demonstrate, I'm going to use one of the uh, dev solar panel, because I can reach everything from here. I have machine sounds turned off right now, but everything everything's moving right now. You can hear it. Ah, we have an issue here. Remember to always check your pipes. Sometimes it bugs out. It leads to issues like this. They have to fix. It's always annoying. So always check your pipe. There we go. Oh, I forgot to attach this to you. Oh. That's an issue. Why was it facing the wrong way? Some of these are facing the wrong way, which is concerning.
So I don't remember putting them the wrong way. Oh well. Six now. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, where is our... Our truck. Truck, where are you? There you are. Look at that. We already have 20 foils. And you weren't running for that long. You see it creates a lot of... A lot of foils quickly. You can hear the sound of industrialization. Look how beautiful that is. And there's nothing stopping you from, like, making multiple, multiple of these. Like, there's nothing stopping you from adding another 10 of these, and another 15 of these, and so on and so forth. There's, there's nothing stopping you there, which is what's really cool about this. We can see, yeah, yeah, around $500 a second is the 540. Is that what it says? 500. 30, I'll, I'll, I'll lower it to 530 uh, per second. Now, the thing is, is that we need to see, that we need to find out, hey, how much is this, how many models is this? So to find that out, we're going to delete all this. You can see you do models. It's 549 models. And that's not too many. If I were to... Let's see here. Let's see how many more models a truck is versus a van. Slash models. Oops. Slash models. It's one model. This counts as one model. Okay, that makes sense. Because I'm pretty sure a model is by how many pipe, pipe connections it has. You see we're already halfway there, which is really nice. That's it for... That's it for today. It's, a, it's pretty good. I'd give it a 7.5 out of 10. For, uh... For overall... Difficulty... Efficiency. Wait, when we say efficiency, it's how much money per model. So right now it's it's nearly a one to one ratio because we have five hundred forty nine, and then five hundred. So we're getting just under the model count. So it's almost a, it's almost one dollar per model, which for a mid game thing like this that's cheap. That's pretty good. That's not bad. Anyways. Thank you all for watching. I hope this helped you. Hope you all have a good day. See ya.